Guys, what's up? Nate Twelve Six Nine Five here, bringing you another episode of Pokemon Fire Red. Let's play. All right, so what? Uh, see, we we ended our last episode in the this rocket warehouse thing in the game corner, wherever it is, and I'm pretty sure we fought both these guys. Yeah, we did. Uh, hmm. Let's see how the Pokemon looking? Okay, so they're doing. They're they're all right. So now what we're gonna do? We're gonna go up here, and boom, Giovanni. I think we fought Giovanni yet, but uh, he's uh, the leader of uh, um, Team Rocket and everything. And uh, yeah, so uh, he he's um pretty strong. He mostly has uh, rock Pokemon though, so uh, ground moves. Uh, uh, I think uh, I don't know. I can't remember, but I think he has a ride. I know he has a ride on too, and I think. Uh, um, oh, Nido Queen, Nido Queen, or Nido King, one of them. Wow, critical on a magnitude 9. It's pretty, uh, pretty powerful. I would hate to have a critical hit on a magnitude 10. That would be awful. Yeah, he's got a rye horn. And, uh, yeah, so just pretty much Doug Trio. Um, hopefully we can keep Doug Trio for the Nido Queen, because that'll, that'll make it so much easier. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> That's irony, I guess. But, uh, let's see. We'll go to Gyarados. And just water pulse. Yeah. And then Nido King or Nido Queen. One of the two. I'm not completely sure. Oh, Kangaskhan. I don't even know where I got Nido Queen. I think... Uh, no. I, I will... I'm not going to say that because that would ruin it for you guys. Um... Wow. Uh, that has a lot of health. We'll see what Water Pulse does. Okay, so this thing is, uh, it's pretty, uh, defensive, I guess. We'll just keep using Dragon Rage. It's the best thing. Oh, wow. Oh, perfect. Um, so yeah, Giovanni, he's easier than, uh, he looks, but, uh, yeah, so, uh, after this, yeah, he drops the, uh, Sylph Scope, which he stole from, uh, Sylph Co., uh, which is, like, I'm not completely sure how to explain what it is, but, uh, yeah. So, now we're back on our way to Basement Floor 1, which is right here. Well, uh, we have, we have to fight this guy. Oh, well. Uh. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that, but oh well, it shouldn't take too long. Uh, I'm gonna switch to Jolteon, maybe. Oh, I need to get some, uh, um, like, thunder, or electric moves for this thing, because it's, it has, like, nothing. Um, and it won't learn anything, I'm pretty sure, till way later. So... I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll find something. Let's see. I, I, don't, I don't know when I'll get Thunderbolt. I know, well, I know it won't, it won't get until way later. But, uh, hmm, oh, of course you get poisoned. I don't know, we'll find something for it. Uh, any, uh, electric moves that we pick up on the ground, we'll try to teach it, maybe. Depending on what they are, anyway, we're not gonna, like, teach it a crappy thunder move. But, yeah. I hate poison. Mm, quick attack like does nothing. Minimize. Maybe if we're lucky. Nope. And of course he uses Harden, but we're dead because of poison anyway, so. Uh, uh, yeah, so Gyarados. Sec, guys. Sorry about that, guys. My uh, mom decided to interrupt. Oh well. Moving on. Uh, so yeah, that's. Oh no, that's not its last one. Sadly. Ugh. I hate. Coughing's are, like so annoying because you, there's like nothing you can use that's super effective against them. Well, other than psychic, I guess. But I don't. 
you don't really get any psychic Pokemon unless you have a Kadabra, which I'm I'm not sure if I'll get one. I, I want one, but uh, I don't know. actually I think after I leave uh, this place, uh, I'm gonna go to the game corner and I'm gonna just uh, get a lot of coins and I'm gonna get one from the thing and I'll train it and stuff on my own, so you guys won't have to you know sit through me. <laughs> training it up to, up to level 16, even though, um, because that, that will take a long time, well, not as long as, uh, um, Magikarp, because, ugh, Magikarp's just awful, but Gyarados is pretty good, I think it's a good addition to our team, so, yeah, that, that, that works out, no, uh, but yeah, so, one, we're just about out of here, this is the last guy, just gotta peck them a chop, and game corner place. I'll, I'll be back in here and uh, probably after the video. Uh, maybe. I don't know. It depends on if we're going to be going somewhere in between. I'm not sure. Because uh, 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 we have to go back to the Lavender Town. I know that. So that's not too far. We'll, I'll come back after and hopefully get an Abra. Well, actually, I do. It makes it so much faster. And then... I uh, See, this game's speeded up. I'm almost going, like, two times the normal speed of the game. And, oh, dang it, I forgot about it. Okay. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going, like, almost two times the normal speed of uh, the game. And and running at the same time. So, and, out, and it almost... Um, still took quite a bit of time. Why didn't I switch? Because I can't even hit coughing with uh, any ground type moves, because it has levitate. Um, but the cut will take it out. Then, ugh, hate smog. Smog is... I just hate poison moves in general. Being poisoned. And it, it sucks, it's like Team Rocket. You fight the most of Team Rocket. It's so annoying. But, oh well, what can you do? And, and see, it, poison, most of the reason it's annoying is because it takes out your health, but it takes out enough so it matters. Like, like you know, like other moves, like, I don't know, Leech Seed or, um, uh, I don't, I don't even know. Like, Confusion's annoying too. Why did I use Magnitude? Oh, wow. This sworn um, it wouldn't have been able to work but on mag magnemite, but oh well, it works. Uh, let's see, go this way. I'm gonna stop her. Thing and then cut into. Uh, it's a long, not that long of a journey actually. I've had to go way longer, but. Of course, I actually fought that guy right down there, but we'll fight this girl, I guess. Uh, get some money to buy some coins and all, because if I can buy the uh, coins for uh, Abra, I might. Because it'll be so much easier um, than you know having to win them, because that's it's just locking. Ugh. Um, the one thing I did like about Pokemon Soul Silver and Heart Golden, those two games, was the um, the game thing you played in that. I would like most of the reason I kept that for as long as I did was because it had that. Because I I like to just play that like just just like that because it was, it was just kind of fun to me to um, you know like logic it out. I guess I made it. I was actually pretty good at it. Um, if any of you guys know what I'm talking about, it might help. It's, um, I don't know, it's pretty much like Minesweeper, but, um, it, it was Voltorbs and stuff, and it was a little easier. But, yeah, so, I'm gonna go through here, and now this is where, um, stuff starts getting annoying, because, oh. <sighs> yeah, 
like uh, right here is where um, no, did, actually I think yeah I'm stupid uh, I don't know if uh, magnitude does affect yeah levitate so dang it uh, so Doug Trio is useless against uh, this pretty much whole place so I don't and so is Jolteon because it doesn't know any um, attacking moves so Gyarados is pretty much going to be the one we're going to use because it knows bite and uh, dark moves are super effective against uh, ghost and psychic so yeah it'll, that'll, that'll make it a little easier and uh, level Gyarados a little bit so that, that'll be nice I'm gonna switch Gyarados up front. Let's see right there. Switch. Uh, escape rope that can come in handy eventually. Uh, I might try to get. Uh, uh, see, actually, I think I'm. I'm not sure if I want to catch a Ghastly because well, I only have one more spot. But Gengar is really good. Well, but I wouldn't get Gengar. I'd get a Haunter because. Yeah. Hmm, not completely sure. Is there an item down here? No, there's not. Uh, see, oh, also before, if you came in uh, without the self scope, um, it these things would show up. Like you wouldn't be able to know what they are. I don't know why. Because um, like any other time during you know the game, if you find a gas leak, you, you know what it is. But like just this in this area, like you have no idea what it is, and that's kind of stupid, but, oh well, um, yeah, so th this should m hopefully, maybe, one-shot it, I don't know, if we're lucky, we'll, it'll use curse, and, oh, oh, never mind, so th this, uh, this way should be pretty easy then, because, uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, so we get this, which, great ball, that can come in handy, have to fight someone either way, because if we went the other way, there was another person, but hopefully we can one-shot this. If not, we'll get lucky, and they'll curse themselves to death. And I didn't want to use Dragon Rage, but oh well. We'll just use uh, Water Pulse to take it out, hopefully. Yay. I, I hate being confused so much. It's one of the most annoying things, because you, you don't know if you're going to hit yourself, and if you do, then it's... Uh, huh. Actually, I guess if you did go that way, you wouldn't have to fight anyone. That's, uh... Strange. Hmm. I don't know. But yeah, we're, uh... We're, I don't... Let's see, I think we're ma about 13 minutes now, something like that. Uh... So... Ah, oh, dang it, of course. I don't, I'm going to stop, like, in, like, a few seconds. Uh, you, you guys will see why. Uh, yeah. So bite that, that'll take it out. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty... Pretty fast. Let's see. Oh, yeah, this person doesn't... Uh, okay, so this right here, it's a purified and protected zone. Your Pokemon get fully healed in here, which is really nice, because you don't have to keep walking out and it's pretty much like Pokemon Center, but free and takes like half the time. So this is where I'm going to save because I can. Yeah, so. Save and thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, like, favorite, and all that jazz. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time and we'll finish the rest of this place and you guys will uh, see what's waiting for us. Alright, so see ya.